decided to make my own custom colour, so I'm using um, Antoinette. Um, I would have gone straight with the Antoinette, but it wasn't um, dark enough for my liking. So all I'm going to do is apply a little bit of a meal to it, just to darken the tone up. Um, so not much, but just enough because I'm going to use white wax afterwards, and I want it to be dark enough to see a contrast. So here you go. What I'm going to do, keep on working on this area, I'm going to stipple into the lace. Carry on this process until you've gone all the way around and then once it's on, you can finish off painting the piece with the colour all over and that will allow this to dry a little and then we'll have the reveal. Now all of the paintwork is, is dried in, after quite a while of drying, um, as you can see it's gone crunchy and hard so the lace has all gone hard that's due to the fact of the decoupaging with Annie Sloan decoupage glue and varnish so this is the last part of the process we're going to apply Annie's white wax. The reason I choose, you could use any of the waxes, the black wax, the dark wax, um, or you could leave it as is, but I wanted the white wax because of the colour really. I wanted it to be very... This is going to come out beautifully. And there we go. As usual, I'm going to carry on with the full project. I will complete. I've got the inside to paint as well. Um, but you will see the end results on my page or at the end of this video. I'll post some pictures there. Um, thank you again for watching and I'll see you next time.